Hey, good morning everyone. Today is Sunday, July 23rd. Finally back to making some pumpkin Sunday videos. Weather has not been great here in Maine. Today we are looking at, uh, at this time, plant number one. This one has really taken off over the past week. Um, I've done a time lapse. So if you want to hop back and look at that short, you can see the growth there of... Uh, one of our pumpkins that we have going on. You can see that pumpkin is uh, maybe the size of a softball. So definitely starting to kick off and get some good growth. What I've been doing is cutting those tertiary vines, but on the main vine as well, I cut the end to try to put more growth into that main pumpkin. Um, so that's what we've been doing with this plant. As you can see, plant number two much less growth um, this morning we finally were able to locate an, an open female flower so i pollinated that this morning like we went over a couple weeks ago so hopefully this plant might catch up and with plant number two i'm just looking to have as many pumpkins as possible but with that plant number one here hopefully that one that's a softball size will really start to kick off I went to a, a grow store that sells fertilizer, plant supplies. I picked up this Monster Bloom. I've been using it on these plants. Um, this one, the amount of phosphorus is uh, that 50 number and that potash is at 30. So I've been reading that uh, once that pumpkin has started to get going, really, up it with the potash so something i've never done before anybody out there have any more advice on the secondary vines on when to clip those let me know in a comment um definitely i think this is behind schedule based on the plant that i did in 2020 but hopefully with the increased uh monster bloom here we can really start to get a large pumpkin I'm going to get some sand, put some sand underneath this, uh, this pumpkin here. I got some plywood ready to go. And also I have some shade cover that I picked up. So once this thing really gets going, we can cover it from the sun. But then again, in Maine, we haven't had much sun. It's been all rain, but today should be a good day for getting some sun to these plants. All right, everybody have a great Sunday. Uh, if you have any questions or, you know, tips, please uh, post them in the comments and please uh, like and subscribe, share if you don't mind trying to hit that uh, 500 mark for subscribers uh, over the past week. We've definitely upped the subscribers there. Really appreciate all the support. All right. Take care, everyone. Have a good Sunday.